all you friendly forest users out there. This is Ian from Echo Station Podcast, and I have a very special video for you guys. Uh, I recently purchased the Women of Star Wars Tops trading card set, and I figured I would do a little unboxing for you since it is May the 4th, and so may the 4th be with you, and so I thought, you know, I would wait. Uh, this came over the weekend, but I would wait for all of you uh, while I unboxed it and to see what I got. Um, I did purchase a second box from a company, I believe they're based out in Florida, called uh, uh, Titan uh, Cards and Gaming, where if you purchase a uh, box like this or some other boxes that they have, they can do what they do is a uh, uh, online YouTube video where they open the box for you, see what you got, and then they send you all the cards. Uh, that way you can do uh, free shipping for it. So I did that. And I happened to snag an Aura Singh autograph, uh, Jamie King from The Clone Wars, so that was pretty cool. Uh, we posted that video on our uh, Twitter a few days ago, so take a look at that um, and see what cards I got in that box too, because I got a few other cool little numbered cards. Uh, but without further ado, let's start uh, with this box. So, like I said, this box uh, came straight from Tops. so um, let's get all these out. All right. So we're gonna set this aside for now. Uh, while doing my research, I was told, and I saw a bunch of people opening the top pack, and the top pack had, oh, let me move these down a little, there we go. The top pack was the one that had the autograph in it, so we're gonna put this one aside for now. Uh, and then we're gonna open up the rest of them. They come with one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, seven packs. I believe there's eight cards per pack. So uh, yeah, let's get started. Um, I also do know that the orange and the blue cards are variants, obviously, and then they uh, aren't numbered, but the greens, purples, and reds are numbered, so those are the more, uh, I believe, sought-after cards, quote-unquote, so let us see what we got in our first pack, shall we? All right, so we're going to throw that away, and then, all right, so... Let's see here, all right, so we got Aunt Z, Lady Proxima, Rio Chuchi, Shumai, Tiplar. Ooh, this is our first kind of, our first hit is what they uh, call it, a green uh, weapon of choice, Jin Urso Blaster, uh, number five of 99. So we're gonna put that up there. I'm gonna put that right here, actually. Uh, another weapon of choice, uh, lightsaber, Ahsoka's lightsabers. And then an orange, unnumbered Ursa Ren from Rebels. All right. So, so far, we got a first hit in the very first pack we opened. That's kind of cool. So, let's see what pack number two has in store for us, shall we? All right. So, we have Bo-Katan. Depa Balaba. Uh, Rig Nima, uh, Sly Moore, Tanwi, Sugi, The Journey of Leia Organa, and an orange Captain Phasma. Uh, these Journey of Leia Organas, uh, there are eight of them, and so this one is her arrival on Takodana from Episode 7, so that's cool. All right. Um, let's see what this pack has to hold. All right, we have Old Daka. Uh, Rumi. Ayla Sakura. Ela, Jin Urso. Mina Bonteri. A powerful pairs of Ahsoka and Barris from the Clone Wars. Uh, powerful pairs number five out of 28. And then we have an orange Padme. So that's cool, we'll put our powerful pairs up here too. Um, there's also sketch cards in here possibly. Um, and there's also, I believe, uh, printing plates as well. So those are other hits as people call them. I'm still learning these terms as myself because this is like my first, you know, big thing, so. Throw that away. Uh, we have 
Pam Pamich, I think. I don't know how to pronounce these names, so I'm so sorry. Uh, the Seventh Sister, Tip Lee. We have Jana, Admiral Haldo, Lyra, a base weapon of choice, uh, Val's grapple gun, and a blue Katuni. Uh, Um, let's open this one up. Some autographs I'm really hoping for would be like Ahsoka's, Ventress. Um, I love the, the three pack or the three autos of uh, Jen, Leia, and uh, uh, Ray. Uh, you know, there's a bunch of autographs that I want, so we'll see what I get. Uh, we have Corsella, Griata, Brew, uh, Agent Tierney. Numa, uh, Valak, uh, we have a base, uh, Iconic Moments, the final transmission in Rogue One, that's a sad one to put in there, good lord, uh, Iconic Moments number 13, so we'll put that uh, up here, and then we have a Orange Mon Mothma from Rogue One. So, last pack before we get to the autograph. Um, let's see what this one has in store for us, shall we? Again, sorry if I'm opening these up like off camera or doing it wrong. This is my first like true unboxing for these things, so you know, sorry. Uh, we have Tam, uh, Sabine Wren, Ray, Paige Tico. Tekla, Zori, a powerful pair of Satine and Bo-Katan. So this is powerful pair number 12. And then we have a, oh, we have a green Lots Razi from the Clone Wars, uh, number 30 of 99. So that's cool. We got a hit for that one. So I'll put you over here. All right. So our final one. Let's see what autograph we got. I don't know. Let's see, let's see, let's see. All right, so we have Zam Wessel, Lovey, Iden Versio. We have Gardula the Hutt, uh, Commander da Dasi, Daisy. All right, so the autograph is under here, so we're gonna keep this. So we're gonna do a blue Mon Mothma from Rogue One. And then under here, we have a powerful pairs of Padme Amidala and Mon Mothma. Uh, powerful pairs number 19 looks like. So we're gonna put that with this one. And, all right, let's see who we got. Let's see. And we have uh, Charlotte Luis as Margot. Uh, I believe she was a Canto Bite uh, patron. So that's cool. Let's see. What was, yeah, let's see here. Uh, not number, but we have an authentic autograph of Charlotte Luis as Margot. So that's cool. So I'll sleeve that. Uh, we may do this as a giveaway at a future con uh, at a panel. I don't know. Might keep it. So I don't know. We'll see. Um, but yeah, so got a few hits in this one. That's great. Um, this is a really fun box to get, especially, you know, if you like, you know, obviously the women of Star Wars, uh, I highly recommend it. I think it's like $50, something like that. So, you know, it's not too expensive and you do at least get, uh, a autograph per, uh, uh, box. So that's cool. Um, but until next time, guys, uh, have a very safe rest of your week and may the fourth be with you.